Hey coach, it's Bryce from Synergy. Today I'm back with some more quick hitters for you regarding the team tab on Synergy. So when you log into Synergy, go to the team tab. Down here in your filters um, with conference, if you have a drop down like this, you can actually choose more than one conference if that's of interest to you to see a list of multiple teams from similar conferences in this sort of team view. So for example, I could go and do the Mountain East and then I can click this drop down again and I could type in the PSAC and then until as many conferences as, as I want. So just something to keep in mind is that ability to have multiple conferences here in this filter if that's of interest to you. So for me, I wanna to go to a specific team. I'm gonna to go to Cal PA. So when I'm on their uh, page, one thing I don't think every coach realizes is there's this game log over here. So over here on the right, you can see all this team's games from the entire season, wins and losses. And you can hover over it to quickly decide, hey, I want to jump into this game. I want to check it out. So I can click all clips, all possessions, or full game if I want to jump straight into that game. Um, so just something to keep in mind. Uh, that's your first quick hitter. Next quick hitter I want to talk about is the stat breakdown toggle. So for example, um, if you're in this play types view, and you know that's a big part of you know what you want to keep an eye on with your team, and you're like, hey, how do I see you know which players are excelling or whatnot in these different you know play types that we log? switch it on to player breakdown. That'll actually make it so that there's drop downs available in each of these tabs. So, you know, if cutting is a big part of your offense and you wanna see, you know, which players are scoring the most or getting scoring chances in those cuts, you can drop this open. And then just like that, it'll, um, you know, have all those players and as well as their ratings to show you kind of how they're doing. So just something to keep in mind, you don't have to go to a player page to see all their play types. You can actually, see how they're doing within these play types, you know, under the team tab as well by having this toggle on. All right, so next quick hitter, talking about some of these toggles, one of the things you can do is when you click on your name and go into settings, you can actually change some of the stat defaults. So right here, if you wanna make sure that you're only seeing total possessions, number rank versus percentile rank, you can actually save those uh, changes in here if that's relevant to you. Okay, so next quick hitter I wanna talk about is on the shot types tab. Uh, what you do is go to the shot clock under four seconds or equal to four seconds. That will help you to see with that player breakdown on as well, who is getting all the shots late in the shot clock. So like for this particular team, it's Collins and then McClurg. Um, knowing that like 33% of the time, this is the kid that's getting those late shots. Hey, maybe that's the type of thing in the off season we can work on with him a little bit more is he's going to be relied upon. And so we want to make sure that we're repping some of that, knowing that, hey, when we do get late clock, this guy needs to be prepared to take those types of shots. Let's rep that a little bit. So just a quick little thing to be able to say, hey, who's getting those kinds of shots within our offense? So, okay, so another quick hitter for you on the shot type tab, scroll down. Coaches don't always realize there's a lot of information on this page. So keep scrolling, keep scrolling. If you have our insights package, there's some shot quality stuff in here as well. You can see shot distance as, as well here. I'm gonna switch it back to all instead of short shot clock. When I go all the way down here to per player breakdown, there's all kinds of different sort of ways for you to see um, different filters. So if you wanna to go to you know points per shot and see your players in here on the types of shots they're getting and then the points per shot that they get on those types of shots, you can do that. Uh, but one thing that's really interesting, a lot of teams, they, they care about how many threes they take, you know, analytics, right? You can actually go down to one of the filters is three point attempts per field goal attempt. Keep in mind, you can only have one of these selected at a time in this particular view, but what I can do there is then I see, hey, you know, who's a dead three? Who's taking the majority of, of their shots as threes? And we can see on this particular team, you know, Whitehead and McClurg, almost half of their field goal attempts are three-point attempts. So uh, something that can be pretty relevant uh, from a scouting perspective, but also self-scouting and seeing, hey, are we, you know, you know doing a good job of, of following the instructions of the coaching staff in terms of the, the types of shots that we want to get? Additionally, you can see like right here, um, you know, this particular player, McClurg, is taking you know, way more um, of their threes as jumpers than, you know, some of the other players on the team, for example, whereas same with this in Calic, like a lot of them are jumpers. Um, you can see how many of them are catch and shoot, um, how many of them are unguarded and guarded. So definitely an area to take advantage of. Find the filters that matter to you. It could be anything, it could be shots missed. And you want to, <laughs> you know, something as simple as that. So use this player player breakdown page. Again, it's on the shot types tab within a team. Uh, you go shot types and just scroll all the way down to the per player breakdown. And then again, you can choose any of these uh, specific filters. Maybe you want to look at some shot quality stuff if you're an insights package member as well. So that's your shot. That's your quick hitters today for the team site tab. Hope it helps.